Now this move was literally one of my favorite moves as a player because really it just is such a different thing to guard. So I want you to be able to picture is if I was walking towards a defender, I'm going to literally laterally bounce to that inside. So now if they were guarding me and they're watching the, the, my actual hips, they're gonna wanna shift in that same direction unless they were ball watching in case I could have a change of direction right out of that. So if they are watching my hips, I got them right where I want them. So right now I want you with the picture landing in your drop position because any bound footwork still lands in a drop, which means my inside foot's gonna go back. Since the ball's in my right hand, that'll be my left. And my right foot, my outside foot will go forward. So I'm gonna comfortably get to the mat and now I've shifted everything over. So I wanna picture they go with me. Now I'm driving right back to that outside again. Now if you look at it, my drop always looks like a drop. That's what I'll always say here. I'm not landing differently. If I was doing a normal drop, you see my feet hit the exact same spots. So as long as you can keep those principles when you do an inverted bound, now you have the exact same advantages, except now you've changed angles and you've made the defender actually try to guess or react to what you're doing.